What's poppin' YouTube? Professor Kuro here back with another reaction. Today we got another four course buffet. Starting off, we got the Yuji Itadori rap song, I Don't Wanna Be Alone, Dizzy 8 featuring Mix Williams. We know what this duo can do. And we know what this duo could do with JJK. And we know what this duo could do on some more heartfelt ish because I'm looking at the title and that sounds like it's gonna be heartfelt. Let's check the description real quick. Uh, produced by Ross. It could either be Gossage or Gosage or Gosage. Uh, if I pronounce the name incorrectly, please correct me. Want we'll to just give credits to everyone that was a part of this. Check out the thumbnail. Thumbnail looking pretty. My man, the door was crying. He got a hard life. He had a bad day that just kept getting worse. My man went through it. But y'all know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Make sure you hit the link, hit the like, hit the comment, subscribe. Show love to everyone that was a part of this. And with that being said, let's get into this track. Three, two, one. Let's run it, baby. <laughs> I already love the video editing on this immensely. Sorry, I just love the ne like the, the 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 negative coloring. I don't know the way the colors change, and you saw like the flash of the Sakuna markings in that scene, which is really dope. And I'm loving how this aesthetically looks. Whoever did the AMV, gorgeous. Visuals by Chris G. I don't wanna be alone. One thing I have to point about the editing, I'm pretty sure on some of the lines, the ends of the words would actually shed tears. So that was just poetic artistry. Uh, love the hook. It's exactly what I I hoped this song would be. The, the guitar, the, the, the melodic aspects to it, the heartfeltness, the I don't want to be alone. I may seem strong, but I, I, it doesn't matter how strong I am. I can't do this on my own. Uh, very true for everyone. Not Fuck Yuji. Everyone can, can relate to that on some level. You, you Going through life on your own, it ain't easy. And no one should. We, we are human beings. Human beings are social creatures. We are not built to be alone. We need at least one. We need at least one. But it's only good as they remember me. I want to be special in your memory. I want to have friends that's here for me. And cherish all the love that you sent for me. I felt so alone and I'm so afraid to be all by myself. So I'm right there for anyone there to feel the same things that I felt. At the end of my life, I want to say I did this thing right. I want to love by myself. Every time I open my eyes, I don't want to be alone. Mm. 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 I love the way one of Yuji's big thing is I want everyone to have a good death, right? But that is a very, very ambiguous thing. What does it mean to have a good death? Is it the mode in which you die? Is it the surroundings? Is it the situation? What is it? And I love the fact that he was alluding to, uh, you know, your heart's only as good as how people remember me. So I'm going to make sure that I have good thoughts in your memory. Like, I want you to remember me for me. And I hope that all those memories are happy ones because I want to be remembered that way. And just kind of going through that, just the whole idea of really accepting, like, finality and be like, I want to make sure that in these moments that I'm here, I have love, I have friends, I have a crew, I have people that can depend on me that I can depend on. And at the end of my life, I want to make sure that I did this thing right. I want to have like kind of that callback to the idea of I want to have a good death, but also I want to make sure that I live my life right and by the way in which I want to conduct myself. So again, just really, really powerful imagery and, and thoughts and emotions from Dizzy that you just love to hear like songs like this, uh, even his invincible track, even his no fear, all my track, like tracks like this, like where you get that, that emotive reflect, even sacrifices, scars, um, Oh man, what uh, I can't remember the name of the Rengoku track, but it's like those those emotive tracks I always appreciate from Dizzy. I mean, even his verse on Fable. I'm going off on a huge tangent. Sorry, bringing it back. Let's get into the chorus. I don't wanna be alone. I don't wanna be by myself. Even though I seem strong, even though I seem strong, I can't do it all by myself. And I need you here with me. 
I got fear in me. I don't wanna be alone. I don't wanna be alone. I don't wanna be by myself. Hop in there, so mix. Ooh, I said I love the fact that I love that line that he opened with. I don't think there's a single person on this planet that understands how much I need to have you all by my side. Like that is just powerful. Like I don't like. I love that idea of you can't even comprehend how much I want y'all here. Like I want like this. I don't think I could put into words. I don't think I could explain it to others. That that imagery was just real powerful. Uh, so I want to run it back just a little bit. Um, I like the whole like being scared of the future because when you have something that's precious to you, you want to protect it, you want to cherish it, you want it there for as long as possible. So now you get to worry about the future a bit more. One of the A side, B sides of, of life. My side, and for the first time in a long time, God, I'm scared of the future and I don't know why. Yeah. How to make sacrifices. Yeah. And I don't want to live alone if that's what life is. I want you all to see how many milestones I hit. Everything that I might get. Share with everyone that I love. Shit, I don't want to be alone. I've been living life out on my own. Get all of my strength from all of you And I don't let you think I'm strong My list of insecurities is long God, I got so much more that I gotta prove I don't, I don't wanna, wanna be alone, alone. I don't wanna be alone Great I don't line. wanna be by myself Even though I seem strong Even though I seem strong I can't do it all by myself And I need you here with me I got fear in me I don't wanna be alone Also, one thing I want to I want to point out oh. <laughs> that, 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 that threw me for a loop for a second. One thing I really want to appreciate uh, in terms of the visuals, the choice of colors was so perfect. Like that, that orange auburn, like that color scheme and scape that was kind of filtered over the video and like apparent when you'd see alone and it would switch into the hook with the grid floor like i don't know why but that color perfectly fit the emotive theme quality space of the song so i just want to really really point that out chris g you did an amazing job on the visuals um ross gossage i love this beat the guitar the melody just the way it all came together and layered dizzy mix what i gotta say yeah absolutely just Y'all took me to the place that I wanted to go and even further beyond. I absolutely love this track. Like, this is definitely going to be one of my, like, Sunday, like, drives. Just, like, looking at the water. Like, really emotive. Just, like, when you need to reflect kind of tracks. Hella, hella love it. Y'all already know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Make sure you hit the link, hit the like, hit the comment. Subscribe. Show love to everyone that was a part of this project. And with that being said, we on to the next reaction, which is One Punch in Freestyle produced by Telling Beats official amv connor quest first of all i fucking love this image because let's be honest it's literally connor quest it's literally saitama cosplaying as connor quest like that's what this thumbnail is um, uh jokes aside let's check out the description uh vocals lyrics connor quest production telling beats video editing geek lizard dope i'm excited for this Y'all already know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Make sure to the link, hit the like, hit the comment, subscribe. Show love to everyone that was a part of this. And with that being said, let's get into it. Yo, yo. One punch in freestyle. Is he gonna, is he, is he, is he going, how we, how we doing this? The joke is that this isn't gonna be one punch in. <laughs> and it's also not a freestyle. <laughs> I just thought it was a cool name. It is a good name. Yo. It's real smooth up my fucking head. Gang the ang the avatar, the words are what I up and bend. Okay, okay. The beat came in on some smooth. And I love how even Connor called that like, yeah, it's so smooth like my fucking head. Like, yeah, this beat is that smooth in Saitama's bald. Also, gangly ang. The words are what I up and bend. Airbender, world bender. I'm the gang ang. Alright, my man getting some gang activity energy. 
Bat my fucking head Gang the the avatar The words I wanna up and bend Rhyme harder than sight Time I can punch your head Follow gut instinct I always keep my stomach clenched Locked on death Story opened up You look rough he said I'm just so bloody stressed Went and had a couple for the road After a vendor drove me up the bend and Okay when I had a couple after a bender up and drove me off the end, bender off on a drinking spree, but also he was hitting some drinks. Death said, you look... If you knock on death door and death says that you look rough, that is just a tough place to be in, honestly. Said, I'm just so bloody stressed. Went and had a couple for the road after a bender drove me up the bend. End of my road, be and feel, I've got nothing left. He said, well, the only slots I've got are one and ten. So that about Wednesday? He said, you're out of luck, my friend. It's not your time, you're not set to keep the bucket yet. You've got a show and tour to do you've got to go and bust that set so i'm back with the three anime geeks when hey. heroes know with vigilantes that hang in the streets kind of a breeze to cover up the smell of cannabis leaves strand of this weed roll it up inside a panel from bleach haha <laughs> roll it up inside a panel from bleach yo my man connor kind of going off right now he's he's sl he's he's sliding through characters and ideas and uh, mental scapes of going from like, yeah, it's bald like my head comedic into the whole death door scheme of talking to death, feeling like you're dead inside because you're hollow if we cl if we, we connecting it back. So he's like, yo, it's not your time. You got to go rock a tour. Talking about the tour that he just had with Shaudo, Rusted, Schwabity, and there was a couple other people on that tour. I can't remember the names off the top of my head that they're touring across the UK. Then bringing that back into the comic, uh, to the manga bars of we're not heroes, we're vigilantes, my hero vigilantes. And then sliding from that into Cannon Febreze to cover up the smell of cannabis leaves. Don't use Febreze, use Ozium. It's a lot better. But cannabis leaves to cover up the smell of cannabis, um, Cannon Febreze to cover the can smell of cannabis leaves. I said that line so many times I forgot the punch for it. Rolled into a panel of bleach because bleach has hollow. So if we connect that back to death door, Shinigamis, he's talking the weed, keeps him alive like Ichigo. Man, yeah, boss that shit. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but I am loving just like the way he's flowing through these different intricate rhyme schemes and thought processes and, and just different, different, not even just like top. Just, he's just flowing. He's fucking water bending right now. The son of a bitch. Freeze to cover up the smell of cannabis leaves. Strand of this weed. Roll it up inside a panel from bleach. Cause the hit feel like rookie your palm. And not a body experience. And I'm usually calm. But I'm freaking out like Scooby when he spooked in the thumb. Still I'm checking out the Velma chick who's moving around. So yo, spin round dizzy the sound. Give me about 50 hours in me bouncing around like I'm bound. I'll be scouring the crowds, but a bit either to rouse in me bow. Chick a wow, pretty missy with the hound in me. Okay. So he took that bleach bar into Rukia Shaka hole like a blast from the pop. Is actually was that is that what he says next? Palm and not a body experience, and I'm usually calm. Okay, I just oh Rukia palming out of body experience because when she puts on the glove and slaps Ichigo upside the head, that's how she pulls out a Shinigami spirit. Okay. Understand, I heard Rukia palm and I went from Raiho, Shakaho, to her fucking Zanpak toe, to all ten of her toes and all ten of her hoes and all ten of her foes. I was trying to remember and then I wrote it back and we got it now. Um, but I'm freaking out like Scooby when he spooked in the thumbs. Still I'm checking out the Velma chick who's moving the Ross. Yo, Velma thick as shit. So, yo, it's been round dizzy, the sound give me about 50 hours in me bouncing around. Round like I'm bound, I'll be scouring the crowds, but a bit either to rouse in me bow. Chick a wow, pretty missy with the hound in me. Haru Petit hopping over to the dancing floor. Likes when I bite her, so I give her what she's asking for. Said I could eat her all night, like it hard, wet and raw. She told me why I've never done it with a carnivore. Stay hey. to us, best to dress me a summer or I go insane, sane and violence, fin the saga gore. You Ooh, address me as Sama. You better you better address me as Lordship. Connor Quest Summer. Puh. For those who don't. Fresh talkers look like Garbador. Volley heads to the ground. Shit looking just like when Tanaka scores. Hey, the hey. platinum end by the Volley heads to the floor that look like when Tanaka scores because also Tanaka's bald like Saitama. Honestly, that kind of looks like Tanaka doing a Connor Quest. I'm sorry. I'll stop making the joke. It was just too fun the first time. It scores, grab the pen, it's platinum end, but that I meant it has effects of arrows red, control the crowd with what my pad has said, outfit, I need a lavish set, inhabitants of soul, was my clothes, mint coat, chain gold, 24 carat neck, vocal hey. tracks, get older cats, throwing jabs, hit back, more strikes than Rengoku raps. Ooh, fuck you, YouTube, for all the Rengoku and Akaza fucking copy strikes and copyrights, you f fuck it.
fucking up my YouTube playlist and shit. Now songs be skipping. I can't remember the set list. Also, I do love the whole um, pen and platinum end with effects like an arrowhead. And I be rocking the crowd with what my pad has said. Pretty much the whole scheme is about how what I write is platinum and it can make it move, make crowds move. I really, really love that. And then also the Zo, Minx, Mink, Co, Mink, Zo, Su Long, One Piece scheme in there too. I kind of want to run that back actually. The end, but that I meant it has effects. If I was red, control the crowd with what my pad has said. Outfit, I need a lavish set. Inhabitants of Zo, was my clothes? Mink, coat, chain, gold, 24 carat neck. Vocal tracks get older cats, throwing jabs, hit back more strikes than Ren Goku raps. I've done more in my home and gaff than you've done on the global map. Spreading shit, shut up, go get vax, dickhead. Damn, that dickhead came from a hearty place. I felt like I'm vaccinated. I felt that. Fuck. But uh, I do love the I've, I've I've done more shit from my home and gaff than you've done on global maps. Like yo, making music in my bedroom. I was on a tour. What you, what you do? Hmm? Hmm? What you do, boo boo? So I'll run that back a little bit. My home and gaff than you've done on the global map. Spreading shit. Shut up. Go get vax, dickhead. This is why. <laughs> I fucking am. And I've proved it time and time again. And I'll keep doing it. That's that. That's fucking that. Yo, honestly though. Whoa, whoa, what was that? Whoa, 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 whoa. You think we won't freeze frame your shit? Hold on, Connor. No, fuck you. That's you think that. I won't freeze frame this shit? Fuck you, bitch. No, I'm not. I'm sorry. No, I'm chat. There's no chat. I'm not even live on Twitch, but we not moving until I see what I want to see. So we gonna put that shit on 25. I don't give a fuck, Connor. No, it was a little bit before. I'm sorry. Transmutation 12, 11, 21. That's two, one, two. What? Wait, it's one, two, one, one, two, one. It's a palindrome date, people. One, two, one, one, two, one. If you read it frontwards and backwards. It's the same shit like the word race car. You don't believe me? Let me type up the word race car. Okay? R-A-C-E. Wait, no, what? R-A-C-E. What? Yeah. R-A-C-E-C-A-R. -E and then if you do it backwards, it's R-A-C-E-C-A-R. -E Boom! Fucking palindromes. Mother. Yeah. But you didn't see that shit coming. We don't need, we don't need French subtitles. Um, yeah. <laughs> Thought you were gonna just... <laughs> fucking slide that thing i wasn't gonna actually spend an extra like three minutes of this reaction to make sure i caught that shit back but honestly though seriously y'all gotta give flowers and respects up to kind of quest like this man genuinely is fucking nasty on the mic with the pen with the flows with the bars his production singing like he is a truly talented artist so y'all better give him all the love all the respect all the flowers all the shouts out in the comments down below y'all already know the deal leave a like and comment down below subscribe to the channel if you're new link in the description the original video make sure the link at the like at the comment subscribe show love to everyone that was a part of this and with that being said i've caught my breath long enough for us to move to the next reaction and we got kona super rap adventurers hustle Area Ace filtering, featuring, not filtering, featuring Delta D's produced by Cadence. I'm excited for this. Look at this thumbnail. They're all so fucking happy. Long story short, I didn't like Konosuba. I watched season one. I thought it was funny. Aqua honestly was the most annoying. Like, people call Zenitsu annoying and, like, Blackstar annoying. Nah. Aqua is single-handedly the most annoying character in fiction to me right now. Like I, like, I understood the point of her character. I understood the humor. But that's the end of my Aqua rant. Now we're going to go to the description. AMV by Black. Shouts out Black. Black's AMVs be hitting so nice. You gotta love them. Stay in the Loop Father family channel. Y'all already know the deal. Y'all gotta, y'all show, show, y'all show Loop some love. Y'all show all the, all the, all the, all the, all the, I always forget the name of this word. Not consortiums. Not clicks. Uh, collectives. Y'all show all the collective loves. But that being said, y'all know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Make sure to link it to like it, comment, subscribe. Show love to everyone that was a part of this. And we go get into this Kona Super rap, baby. I'm excited. Area hey, 8, baby. Delta D's. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> On your block, turn that shit to kind of silver. Fakes on screen, but they ain't be tubers. Hey, got water, but he's still a damn loser. Mega means someone come get they boomer. Big 
I like that. I like the Megumi. Somebody come get they boomer. Somebody come get they they Karen. You know what I'm saying? Because Megumi got the back it in the explosive explosion ability. And I also love the fix on the screen, but they ain't VTubers because VTubers are literal virtual personas. So by inherent definition, they are created, but you fake on a different level. Big body whip. By the whip, turn your bitch to a chosen. Huh. Still a hoes, I ain't need a tutor. Hey. Punch in my face, man, that track don't suit you. I can run your bill for some new damn sutures. Hey, literally the track suit that, 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 um... Fuck, what is that panty, snitch, panty snatching motherfucker's name? Kazuma. Kazuma. Kazuma's track suit. And also the track the track suit, but also the stealing your girl. I don't need no tutor because literally his steel skill is steel. So stealing your girl. I like that. I like that. I can pick and pop at your top like Luca. Drain hey. to his roof. He gonna need a whiz to patch it. White G nights with the Dark Souls added. Stop a nigga with him. Black magic. These hey. rappers dead set on scaling <laughs> to me. Nights with the Dark Souls added. Stop a nigga with him. Black magic. These rappers dead set on scaling to me. They be lucky to walk with a gram. Drain hey. their walls cause they can't hold a flow. If you can't hold the flow, then I don't give a damn. Hey. Puff I love that. That I love that. White Nikes with the Black Souls added to him. Um, we gonna stop him out. Black magic. That just that that don't don't. I love that Ace has really really refined his ability to flip energies. Where he's like da 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 da. da. Like the fact that he was sweat like smooth and then hit that little grit and then brought it back. I really really love that technique. And artists like him, Peso, and Ariel's been doing it and he's been getting better and better for the for since since. And I absolutely love hearing that on this track. Cram, drown on their walls cause they can't hold a flow If you can't hold the flow then I don't give a damn Bitch, puffing out and don't know Sanskrit My cabbage on transit Puffing on Indo no Sanskrit? Did he really just use a mess? Did he just go ancient Mesopotamia on a bar? Is that what just happened? Did Ariel Ace just hit us with the cradle of civilization into a dot Like... Yo, he said Puffa no Indo no Sanskrit. Okay, okay, okay. This motherfucker go crazy. My cabbage on chance. He's talking about my green. He's talking about either the green or the green. And either way, that shit on the way. Because you couldn't carry the weight that was about six bars ago. Yeah, that gram, you still can't rival that. John Transit, you hit your my band with manual hey. stick shift, man. Nick, hey. pull a beam with a scope. Smoke from it to the priest to a post. Hey. Nine five, I speed up my foes. You hey. immune with the means the mission to outshine all the culture to blow. Showing the fit, on, on. Like on transit. Yeah. You hit show my band yeah. with manual stick shift, man. Yeah. Nick, pulling out a beam with a scope. Yeah. Smoke from it to the priest to a post. Nine five. Got a beam with a scope. Smoke on it. Turn a priest to a pope. Beam scope smoke pope. Did he just assassinate the Pope? Is that what that scheme was? Because if you're turning a priest into a Pope, that means you had to get rid of the previous Pope. And that only happens through death. And did I miss something in the world? Was there like a moment where we thought the Pope died at some point in the past like three weeks to a month? Because I swore I saw that on Twitter and I bugged out for a second. Comment down below. 9-5 high speed on my phone, but also you working a 9-5, to five, but also you catch the 9 or you catch the 5, you know what I'm saying? I pass speed of my foes. Union with the means, the mission to outshine all the culture to blow. Showing hey. no fear, my hands common, but no commoner here. Mask up, chop a fill him up, make his crown bust like such as a motherfucker copper name in their sign. Young nigga really bragging, but hey. fill him up, make his culture to blow. Showing no fear, my hands common, but no commoner here. Mask up, chop a fill him up, make his crown bust like such as a motherfucker copper name in their sign. Talking about filler crown, he had a whole dentistry scheme into that cop and they veneers. That was really dope because crown, when you crown a tooth, you put a cap on it, but also cap, also filling. That was dope. Young nigga really bragging both. Talk cholesterol adipose while I smash your hoe. Talking cholesterol adipose, fat tissue. Talking cholesterol, fat. Oh, you know I love them science bars. Talking cholesterol adipose. Like striking a pose, but the flip is that it's a double entendre for adipose, which is literally the scientific name for fat tissue. Oh, I like that. I smash your hoe, throw a cast teeth, nash the most, betray gun, call a basket dough, too easy. Throw a cast teeth, nash the most, betray gun, call a basket dough, too easy. Run up on your block, turn that shit to corner silver. Fakes on screen, but they ain't VTubers. Neck got water, but he's still damn losing. Mega means someone come get they boomer. Big 
by the whip, turn your bitch to a chooser. <laughs> Still a hoes, I ain't need a tutor. Punch in my face, man, that track don't suit you. I can run your bill for some new damn sutures. One up on your block, turn that shit to corner kind of silver. Fakes on screen, but they ain't feed tubers. Neck got water, but they still damn loser. Mega means summer come get day boom. Yeah, yeah. By the whip, turn your bitch to a chooser. <laughs> Still a hoes, I ain't need a tutor. Punch in my face, man, that track don't suit you. I can oh. run your bill for some new damn sutures. Uh, whoa, we set them up and we knock and set off. I pop a V just and I'm up and shut off. I'm on they neck, I can't let off. Watching them die, help me get off. Got a bad blow on this, that like it raw. Her boyfriend don't do one now. She fucked me for who I was, oh. Better f I mean, Darkness's entire character personality is she's literally like a humiliation exhibition. Like, she, she just, can you treat me worse? Can you? Can you physically hurt me more? I don't like it. I don't like it. That's her entire character. So I really like that he schemed that so dopely. If I die and I'm born in a different world, then I still be surrounded with hoes. She hey. brought a friend, I'm fucking them both now. Mm. I caught the face off a profile. Mm. Got so many thoughts on profile. Took her pennies, I'm dirty, I'm low down. Mm. If that one hoe working, I'll go out. Turn that show up, show they gon' show up. Oh. Slide on your black, turn the shit to console. I know killers, dealers, boosters. I see shawty in my future. Way too thick, she can't be human. Headache, I love her though. Other hoes ain't coming close. Man, they used to come and go. I let one in, I sent one home. Run up on your block. Hey, he said used to come and go. I let one in. <laughs> this is Pokemon, bitch. I'm running a Nuzlocke. You guys can't stay. Y'all got to come and go. This, this ain't a revolving door. It's a, it's a one time. It's a one stop shop. And you got stop and shop. You stop shop and you get the fuck out. That's what you got to do. I turn that shit to kind of silver. Fakes on screen, but they ain't feed tubers. Neck got water, but he's still a damn loser. Mega means summer come get day boomer. Big body whip, turn your bitch to a chooser. Huh. Still a hoes, I ain't need a tutor. Punch in my face, man, that track don't suit you. I can run your bill for some new damn sutures. That was a great chat. Hey, yeah. Love the beat, actually. Uh, Cadence, good shit with the production. I'm gonna hit the description, run time more time. Shout out Blacks for the video. I love Delta D's verse as well. I really, really love just the 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 fact the auto tune as well as just how smooth it was provided really great parody and balance to the track as a whole. And when I say parody, I mean parody in terms of differentiation between the verses and the hook and everything. So sonically, it becomes a different space with that feature. And I really love when features add that aspect to the tapestry of a song. So this is a really, really dope song. Yeah, I already know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Make sure you hit the link, hit the like, hit the comment, subscribe. Show love to everyone that was a part of this. And with that being said, we're moving on to the final reaction of this four-piece buffet. There has been some people, some supporters of the channel, that have asked for this track probably for as long as I've been doing reactions. Okay? Not exaggerating. So today, we finally doing it. Casey Edwards featuring Victor Borba, Bury the Light, Virgil's Battle Theme, Devil May Cry 5 Special Edition theme music. This reaction is going to be a lot of me just enjoying the hell out of this song because I ain't played DMC5. And I probably won't for a while. But I'm a huge fan of the series, played 1 through 4, played DMC, love these characters. So I'm just excited to hear a really, really dope song. And you yeah, already know the deal. Leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And let's 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 enjoy a track. Let's let's do it. We we here. We here. Y'all wanted it. We doing it. Let's go. Also, can we just talk about how great like video game graphics are? That that looks like a photo, not like a video game freeze frame kind of. Loving the build.
drop was a lot more intense and dope than I expected. I was like, all right, this is great build, great but that drop hit. I was like, ooh, okay, okay. So we, we go into this side of rock music. So Virgil, we hitting this side of you. Shall I break down some of the lyrics? I just love the connection of having temptation being a mood that can condemn you. And as you fall to your knees, you summon the strength, not to fight against it, but of the chaos that comes with it. Backing melody. Honestly, I need to play DMC five. The storm approaching, provoking black clouds and isolation. He said, Yo, y'all heard about Cumulo Nimbus? Nah, I'm Cumulo Regalis. I'm bringing in all the storm clouds and hitting you with some shit you ain't never seen before. I am the storm. I'll bring that dark cloud energy together. And when that lightning strikes, ooh, hoo hoo hoo. Pause it for a second. Uh, one thing I love is the the light and dark imagery that, that that's that's happening, and it's a lot of dark imagery. You know, my family crest is the demon of death. Uh, you know, phoenix ashen dark. Um, but what's interesting is that I, I I'm correct me if I'm mistaken, but I believe Virgil is a nephilim, uh, if that's the the term they use in that in that universe. But he is half. I believe he's half demon, half angel. Uh, I believe he's the twin brother of Dante and the demon son of Sparta, who was the ruler of hell or a very, very big dog general in hell. So I love the balancing of light and dark themes. Um, and I love that line, destiny chasing time. It's that almost it, to me, I take it as the idea of I am destined to do something, but I'm in a race against time to do what I am destined to do. So destiny chasing time. I, that, the, it's a line that just brings up a lot of interesting internal dialogue and imagery for me. So that's why I wanted to point it out. Surrounded by fate. That line has to be a direct call out to Dante because I don't think Sorry, I started hearing Arabic music out of nowhere and it really threw me off. But um yeah. That line has to be a direct call out to Dante because I'm pretty sure in DMC 
or at one point they retconned that Dante did not remember his childhood twin brother due to some accident or something happening. Um, so I think that might be the call. Because when he said truth revealed in eyes of ember, I'm like, it could be the ember of flames or literal someone's eye color being ember. So I just wanted to bring that up real quick. <laughs> the instrumental the beat the production in terms of just all of it is just so amazing so amazing and and the the latter part of that last verse chorus bridge however you want to call it really brings into perspective their uh dante and virgil's connection because that every every timeline by the end of it they eventually have to fight each other like they are eventually going to be the obstacles that the other must overcome like that is just how they're predestined that is how Virgil's obsession is. That is just how it always ends up being. So I like that that was how that how that was articulated with the latter part of that last vocal section.
song. fucking song love the background visuals of it being parts of the gameplay love the fact that virgil just stared at me the entire time but no overall this was genuinely a dope as hell track um really really like the way it kind of brought into perspective aspects of his relationship with dante his relationship with sparta his relationship with himself that idea of burying the light it also makes me think of the uh of kylo ren as well that idea of burying the light to truly give up on good give up on the light Truly resign yourself to the life and the actions that you are about to take. True acceptance of oneself or the intentions that one has. So this was really dope. You already know the deal. Leave a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Link in the description of the original video. Show it some love. Check out the song. Check out Devil May Cry 5. I really appreciate everyone that motivated me. One very particular individual who made sure that I ended up doing this reaction. And I genuinely enjoyed doing it. So with that being said, y'all, I will catch you guys in the next reaction. Peace, love, and all that good stuff. Deuces, Shigaraki drops October 1st, and we excited for that shit.